Welcome to Slovenia's presentation on urban and rural development. From rural environments to big cities, we're doing everything we can to create a green future for Slovenia. Let's start by presenting the greatest natural wealth of our country, forests and wood. Forests cover more than one half of our territory. Today, the importance of forests and wood is greater than ever before. Slovenia, the green heart of Europe. Discover opportunities of its green, creative and smart wood industry. Driven by sustainable and innovative architecture for a healthy living environment. Create a green future with wood. Our first speaker definitely knows the significance of living in harmony with nature and thus creating a green future for Slovenia. His favorite leisure activity is to attend to the family apple orchard at his farm. He is a member of the European Parliament, representing the Slovenian People's Party, SLS, in the European People's Party, EPP, political group. He is a big proponent of healthy, homegrown food and the smart villages concept. This is the answer how to stop depopulization of rural areas. We know that uh, globalization and uh, also digitalization made big changes in last years. It starts by traffic, uh, by roads, by uh, environmental infrastructure, social infrastructure, cultural infrastructure, health infrastructure. But at the end of all, you need also quality broadband connection if you want to work from at, ho at home, if you want to have small business at home, or if you want to be connected with, uh, with the world of 21st century. The robots, sensors help to work. We have daily robots. We have many sorting machines which use uh, robots, sensors, and the work on farm is much more efficient and it's easier for farmers to work this uh, hard. Uh, there are in last year's uh, many opportunities with uh, new digital platforms, how to connect uh, people who produce food and consumers. There are many things uh, which are connected uh, with uh, other sectors, social care, e-health. These are things which we can do much better for people who live in rural areas in this 21st century and in uh, smart villages uh, concept. In Slovenia, we have a very good example, uh, NGO Supotniki, together with volunteers on one side and municipality on another side, offer free travel for people older than 65 years in rural areas. There are also many opportunity in energy sector. Sometimes you need also uh, some digital tools also for energy sector and uh, to be as active, proactive consumer uh, part of electricity, uh, electricity system. It's very important that in, on national level people, uh, politicians and also all other people understand this concept and that they are involved in this. Through these activities I am sure that uh, the heart of uh, Europe what the rural areas us will uh, develop in next years and uh, uh, Slovenia play here a very important role. In smart villages concept, we think about people. We don't think about business and about big money. People are first and essential for this, this concept. Not only smart villages, Slovenia has actively started implementing its smart specialization strategy for urban living. One of the tools for its implementation is SRIP, Strategic Research and Innovation Partnership for Smart Cities and Communities. Mr. Matyash Logar will briefly present the strategy. Slovenia actively participating in implementation of Smart Specialization Strategy. One of the tools of Smart Specialization is Strategic Research Innovation Partnership Smart Cities and Communities. Smart Cities and Communities partnerships com compose uh, several industrial verticals such as quality of urban living, health, mobility, logistics and transport, ecosystem of smart cities, uh, and several uh, horizontal enabling technologies, such as Internet of Things, Internet of Services, uh, high power computing, big data, uh, digital transformation. Smart cities and communities partnership started uh, like four years ago. 
it was a new initiative in the Slovenian uh, environment and we have quite uh, challenging times at the beginning of the start. -it. We are also one of the larger smart uh, strategic research innovation partnership with more than 130 members. And uh, after a few years, we managed to stabilize our, our activities. Uh, smart citizen communities' main goals is create a supportive synergies between the businesses and research organizations, creates connection between the state and members of the smart citizen communities partnership, promotion of membership and their products, and presents new solutions and products uh, for improving the quality of life in the cities. Uh, we are sure that we will represent one of the strongest players in the implementation of the Green Deal. The digital transformation we are facing these days has a great impact on economic growth and quality of life. Digital transformation is also one of the priorities of the European Union. Mr. Andre Kotar, the chair of the Program Council at Smart Cities and the Communities Strategic Partnership, will explain Slovenia's approach. In Slovenia, we united behind national declaration to boost digital transformation of cities, communities and villages towards sustainable smart society. Based on national declaration, a strong cooperation of all stakeholders is uh, committed, including national and local governments, wider public sector companies, universities, um, research institutions, non-government organizations and others. With such a strong commitment of all stakeholders, Slovenia is in great position to become a reference smart society country. Also, our European partners have recognized that, and together with them, we are preparing for reference smart society projects within select Slovenian towns and communities, uh, which will be implemented uh, during the Slovenian presidency of the European Union in uh, 2021. With this reference uh, project, Slovenia shall become an example for others to follow in Europe and global. A great example of urban development is Slovenia's capital, the city of Ljubljana, which was declared European Green Capital of 2016. Since then, Ljubljana continues with its great practices in being a green, creative, sustainable and smart city of the future. More on that will be presented by Ms. Tiasha Fitzko, Deputy Mayor of Ljubljana. Ljubljana is among greenest capitals. With more than 560 square meters of green areas per capita, it has almost three quarters of all the city services that are green. And we are additionally greening it. We turned 100 hectares of brownfield into additional recreational areas and parks when people can rest, relax, socialize and enjoy their lives. We know that traffic has been one of the key challenges of modern urban communities and we have successfully implemented some great changes in the field of sustainable mobility in Ljubljana. For example, we have changed the heartbeat of the city by closing the city center for motorized traffic. Not one street, but almost 11 hectares. We implemented electric vehicles with drivers that people can use for free. We even built additional bridges to shorten the distances. The results of our bike sharing system Bicycle are exceeding our goals and expectations every year. And 100% electric car sharing system is getting more and more popular. That is really just a small part of the many changes, more than 2200 projects that we have successfully implemented in Ljubljana so far with one key goal, additionally improve high quality of life for our citizens. I will turn to the future and tell you that right now we are setting our new vision, Ljubljana 2045, where we will follow our green and sustainable path as it already is in our DNA and additionally strengthen our digital component for upgrades and greater connectivity of our existing city services and new innovative solutions. As you can see, Slovenia loves innovative and digital solutions and is highly successful in implementing them to both urban and rural environments, all with the goal of creating a green future and a low carbon society. Let's connect and share best practices for a better future. And make sure to visit us at Expo 2021. Thank you for your attention and see you soon.